Hey you guys and welcome to the world of gluten free with your host Christina. That's me. Okay, so we're going to try this Harvest Butternut Spaghetti Squash Spirals. Now, it doesn't look exactly like the package, of course, so I didn't have the green leaves, but it looks very appetizing. It's my first time trying this, and yes, this is gluten free. It should say it's somewhere. Did Grandma cut it off? Ah, she did. Well, I am sorry to announce that my grandma cut off where the gluten free was. That's okay. Yes. But I couldn't really find the gluten free on this package actually the first time I went because I really wanted to try this. So I went on their website again and they did announce that it was gluten free. So if you don't know and if you can't find it on the package, go on their website at TraderJoe's.com and find their uh, where this is on. It should tell you. All right. So I made it. And it took only probably about 20 minutes for everything to get done settled. So I like butternut squash soup. So hopefully I'll like this butternut squash biscotti. First bite going in. Okay, come on. First bite. Okay. So, it's not bad. It's not too great. But if you like the bitterness, then this is for you. This butternut spaghetti, this is definitely for you. For some reason, I think I like it within a uh, soup form better than the spaghetti form because I never actually had butternut squash within its regular form because I've only had it within a soup base form so but I'm still gonna eat it and mm, would I get this again probably not it's not that I don't like it it's just that it's too bitter and I don't like a lot of bitter things for me, I have to have a balance between my sweet and bitterness, like cocoa and chocolate. Mix it all together and what do you get? Cocoa chocolate. <laughs> but besides, take another bite. This time I'll have to try to do a chunk. Okay, let's see. It's not so bad when you have these beautiful, look at these, these beautiful tiny chunks in there of the butternut. Because this, this is golden. This is beautiful. And it's a little bit sweet. Mm. Yes. I probably would get it just to get the little tiny... <laughs> <laughs> chunks of the butternut but butter but butternut squash but all in all if you're a person and you you like bitter foods like this i would say go ahead and give it a try and uh yeah pretty much that's it go to trader joe's they're pretty awesome great prices uh, I'm probably going to do another haul within the next two weeks for next month. And, uh, that's it for me, you guys. So, have an awesome day and, uh, bye.